All right, let me cut across to our reporters who've been tracking uh, different parts of Delhi, the air quality index as it worsens. I'd like to find out from them what's the situation on ground as of now. These are live images as it comes right behind them. Abhishek Anand who joins us, Piyush Sharma and Anmol Bali. Uh, let me start with Abhishek Anand. Abhishek, you're in Noida. In terms of the air quality index, it shows slightly better than Delhi, but we saw all through the night, I was witness to it and a host of others, uh, we heard unabated uh, bursting of firecrackers as if there's no respect to the Supreme Court order whatsoever. Well, Lavila, while we are speaking, while we are talking, the firecrackers are still going on. This is the first thing which I want to tell you. Second thing is, we have been reduced to enjoy poor. We seem to have a problem with your connection, Abhishek. I'm going to try and patch you back. But in the meanwhile, let me cut to Piyush Mishra, who's joining us from Vijay Chowk in Delhi. Piyush, go on. What's the situation on ground? Is the air still worse? Are you doing all right? Have you got reactions from the public? Well, absolutely, Nabila. The situation continues to worsen in national capital. Right now, I'm reporting from Kartavya. Has not improved. Like you were showing the reports to our viewers as to how politics continues to take place, but the situation has further deteriorated. I'm right now reporting from Kartavya Park, and uh, in normal days when air quality is uh, almost a very in, uh, in in very good category, we think we, we could clearly visible, we think we could clearly see in the data from this very point. But today it is not visible. The Visibility level is also reduced to all time low. You can see as to how India Gate, which is a, a on normal day, is visible from this point, is not visible. And that's because the entire area has been engulfed into a layer of a thick fog. Though people who are on Diwali vacations, they have come here in large numbers uh, and they are forced to inhale the hazardous air. And we are right now showing the reality check from the spot, from the ground, from Kasabe Patar. And from this very spot, uh, during normal days, we can clearly see Minja uh, Gate from Nekedai. But today it is not visible because of um, the situation which has now worsened. At one side, how are the party blames BJP for inciting people for uh, working firecrackers? On the other side, uh, BJP continues to hold pressure over how are the party ground, not only in Delhi, but also in Punjab. Uh, BJP is saying that uh, uh, the situation has not worsened because of uh, uh, the working firecrackers, but because of the Continuous stubble burning. In fact, CJP is also coming out with a data saying that out of 1,400 uh, cases of stubble burning in the entire uh, north region, 900 have been reported from Punjab only. So BJP is now asking questions from Amali Party, but Amali Party is saying that. Uh, all right. Well, blame game, unfortunately, is, wa is uh, what is playing out instead of actually diving into finding solutions. Uh, let's just hope uh, we move on from actually uh, political uh, ego clashes here and find an actual solution for the uh, troubling situation. Anmol Bali, who joins us live from Connaught Place. Anmol, how bad is the air quality at this point? Uh, you know, at, this, at the moment, even if Delhiites want to speak up, they really have no moral standing They've indulged in bursting of firecrackers, being mute spectators to people who are doing so. Uh, so it's, it's really for all of us to bear the brunt now. Navila, the current situation of pollution in the national capital and the air quality is in very bad state. If I talk about the current AQI in the national capital, that's trans 358, which comes into the very poor category. And the data which I'm citing is from Center Pollution Control Board. And as you can see, this is around 6 uh, in the evening. And uh, still you can see a thick layer of smoke which has engulfed national capital as well as the adjoining areas. Today, Delhi Environment Minister, Environment Minister Gopar held a press conference where he blamed Bharti Janta Party Haryana as well as Uttar Pradesh, both states which are ruled by the BJP and he said that uh, the crackers which were brought in the national capital were brought from these states and the administration from these states helped uh, traders to, to buy crackers and to sell them in the national capital. On the other hand, Manoj Tiwari also targeted Gopal Rai and said that Aam Adi parties and anti-Hindu party, they are, why they are behind, they, why they are blaming a Hindu festival for the pollution in the national capital. But big question arises here that this is an every 
every year phenomena why government is not focusing why opposition is always targeting uh, he also discussed about the odd and even he uh, gopar rai said if uh, the pollution situation in the national capital will exceed the severe or very severe category again government could think about to implement odd and even in the national capital when asked about the uh, artificial rain he said consultations are going on with iit kanpur and if the situation deteriorates then they could also initiate uh, artificial uh, cloud seeding to rain the national capital and to bring the aqi to the normal or to some less levels nabila you know stay with us anmol i'm going to cut to abhishek anand who's uh, in noida abhishek go on I, your audio seems to be okay now please tell us on in noida firecrackers were uh, being burst all through the night you said you were witness to it too what's the air quality like at the moment well the air quality is still in very poor category nabila i um, i must tell you two things here first is the wind speed is slightly improved and as a result the air quality has improved but it's still in very poor category unfortunately we have been reduced to celebrate poor now the second thing is there are still firecrackers going on when we are talking the firecrackers can be heard right now so this is the ban on firecracker has gone for a task and there is you know there is no stopping of this there's no pause for this bad air quality as far as the firecrackers and the stubble burnings are concerned both the things are making the air quality in entire ncr very in very poor to hazardous category also the construction and the dust of the construction materials are making things worse especially in the parts of noida and greater noida where construction of high rise buildings are going on uh, right behind me you can still see the fog in the air this is the smog in the air and you can see how vehicles can easily cutting through the smog and this is the situation across noida and greater noida in fact gaziabad the visibility was subsequently down after the fire crackers were used at the expressways noida greater noida expressway agra expressway and also nh24 so right now the situation remains to be in a very poor Despite category Despite all the campaigns but, uh, put into action by the delhi government for example diya jalao pataka nahi uh, they asked for people in fact the supreme court even banned the use of green crackers even green crackers are not allowed until january first week uh, but yet we saw people coming out with sheer sentiments and emotion on the day of diwali and indulged in bursting of firecrackers saying that it's not the number one contributor to pollution so why stop us well uh, pollution effects of pollution versus religious sentiments that's what's playing out outrightly in the national capital here as we are now bearing the brunt of severe air quality